3,000 kilometers, 16 technical students, fossil-free energy, powering a brand new solar car. Every two years, the Bridgestone World Solar Challenge takes place in Australia. The team with the most wins under its belt is the Vattenfall Solar Team. The team consists of 16 students of Delft University in the Netherlands. With their solar car, Nuna, the team competes against dozens of other student teams from all over the world. The race starts in Darwin and finishes 3,000 kilometers south in Adelaide. Every day, the students wake up at 5 a.m. to charge their solar car, prior to the race day starting at 8 a.m. Each team has three drivers who alternate every three hours. The other team members and a support crew drive along in convoy. Together, they take care of tasks such as racing strategy, monitoring the weather, changing tires, fixing electronics. At 5 p.m., all solar cars have to stop. The teams camp alongside the road. It takes about five days for the winning car to reach the finish line in Adelaide. Will Nuna be first once more? Racing purely on solar energy is challenging. It's about technology, innovation, strategy and perseverance. And ultimately, it's about the Vattenfall mission, enabling fossil-free living within one generation.